What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'd like to talk about some changes coming to the horses in Diablo 4. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course if you enjoyed the video hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well. Now when it comes to some of the changes, we've all heard about some of the buffs coming to the classes, especially the sorcerers and the barbarians uh, in the upcoming update. But one thing that I think a lot of people may have overlooked or maybe didn't you know kind of catch during the talk of what they're going to change uh, was some changes coming to the horses in game and that's been one of the big complaints in the community is the horses just do not seem to you know really interact with the world that great horses will now be able to break through barriers when you use charge as opposed to you hitting one and kind of getting off awkwardly. We know that that's always been an issue. You kind of hit the barricade, you kind of fall off awkwardly, and then you're kind of in a fight with a bunch of you know, enemies around you. Killing the barricade and the enemies, then waiting for you, uh, your cooldown to return. So that's kind of how that's going to work. Horses will no longer get stuck on literally everything you encounter on the map as you ride uh, just kind of through the map and interact with the world. And horses will no longer be on cooldown if you get off one to climb up or down a cliff which was very, very annoying. You know, there's a lot of different areas in the game, especially if you're in a hell tide where you might get on your horse and ride. That's one place that I have noticed is a lot. You have to kind of either climb up, you know, a hill or down a hill or climb over like a little bridge. Once you get on the other side, your horse is on cooldown. And that is kind of an issue in my opinion, because that's just kind of a, a, a almost quality of life annoyance. You really, in my opinion, should not be on cooldown if you had to interact or do something within you know kind of the game itself but overall the horses hopefully will interact and work better with the world once these changes kind of take effect i'm kind of curious what you guys think um, do you think there needs to be more done uh, to the horses personally i kind of wish we had a way to have more speed boost it don't seem like it lasts as, as long as it should or maybe just a way to do some things where we can upgrade our mounts uh, throughout, you know, maybe some of the crafting we can do in game. Maybe not necessarily a crafting item that would upgrade your mount, but a way to go to, you know, the stable and actually actually upgrade that mount just overall. Maybe speed, maybe stamina time, just some, just in general things I think that would make horses a lot more enjoyable in game. But these fixes that are imp implementing this time are more of kind of quality of life changes, but I think that is definitely a good direction for them to be going with and hopefully down the road we'll get some better changes to this the horses overall anyway leave me a comment with your thoughts and i'll catch you all next time peace